Welcome back to the Return to Raven Creek series. I'm Fire Nation and this is Bessie Foss's story. How's it going everybody and thank you for joining me on another fantastic adventure with our gal Bessie Foss. We are currently in our new quote unquote hideout. 10 months, 10 days, 21 hours, 17,132 Bambinos dispatched. And I'm going to put my military gear back on. We'll probably put this welding stuff away for now. We need to not the back we need to maybe think about just putting some simple barricades up for now and then we can work on more advanced stuff later but i have heard tale that the ready prep uh surplus store is just below us that's that building that was spewing out all the damn zombies so i want to get over to that and check it out it's been a little while since we've really looted some good stuff okay let's Take our sleeping tablets. Bada bing. I'm going to make this episode a little bit longer. Because I know I didn't... Like the last week or so. I didn't really have the time to put in a ton of uh, content into the, into the video. So, And I've had an extended break from PZ. So I feel like playing. Don't at me. Alright, now she's got her aviators on. Also, it's cold as hell here. I've been freezing. <laughs> I got my heater turned on and the temperature set so if it kicks on you might hear a little in the background of the mic but side eye side eye with you side eye with me okay pick this up thank god i only had to work two days this work week that last six day shift <laughs> yeah did a number on my back so i'm still recuperating but Tis what it is. Next paycheck should look pretty good. Let's get out of here. Also, I'm probably going to... Uh, somebody suggested to sledge the wall down over here to get that Bambino up out of there. Because I ain't want to live with no damn Bambinos. They're going to be chewing on the electrical wires and stuff in this place. Can I not get some water out of here? They're going to ruin all the insulation. I just heard it groan too. Yeah. Like dealing with a bunch of uh, rats in our base and we don't want no rats in our base yeah it's definitely it's like right here in this little pillar it must have spawned in there either when i came to this area ooh, ooh, 30 frame rate huh jeez either when i came to this area oh i know why yeah it's because of oh my god it's chunking all that and being in a run for 10 straight months Okay, let's, uh, I think we might need some more weapons here. And we'll put our propane or our metalworking stuff away. I'm gonna take one of these. Oh, I've got a wood axe with me. Nice. Awesome. Um, we'll keep the hunting knife. Sure. All of this. Oh, that was weird. All of this can go away, though. We'll probably need to put some stuff in the seat. Oh, perfect. Just the propane stuff. And then I'm going to grab another spear too. I am. Um, if you didn't ke catch the, the last stream. Oh, we got two of these. Perfect. With survival knives. Uh, Greta Cole went out in a fiery blaze. Kind of how we wanted to. Um, God, the lag. I do want to start with the day one mod. In the next couple streams. And the next stream was probably, let's see, this video will go up Monday night. Yeah, so it'll be Tuesday morning. So before I go live and after I record tomorrow's video, I'm going to uh, hop into the day one mod and check it out, try and get it all set up. Hopefully it doesn't lag too much. I honestly don't know why the game's running so poorly right now like my frame rates jumping up and down weird normally I'm sitting at a, like a normal I don't know 50 55 FPS it's probably because I just loaded into the game and we're in, in downtown Raven Creek and there's a butt ton of zombie corpses around the area it'll be real nice once they actually uh get that kind of optimized so somewhere down here the top hanger there's like a ready prep surplus store 
from what I've been told. Let's stay low, see if we can't get ourselves some sneaking XP. That's another skill that we want to get to 10. I'm not getting anything. That's kind of good because that means these two buildings haven't spawned zombies yet. The top hanger, huh? I have no idea what that is. Also, I might need a sledge to get in. Not 100% sure. But I do want to find the place first. Get out of here, good sir. You get. 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 Oh, get out of here. Did you finally break out of that place you were in, old mate? It looks like this place is having a sale. Yeah. I don't think the building's for sale. I was going to say that, that would suck. If it's like a house and uh, it's for sale and there's just nothing in it. Ooh, that looks promising. Ooh, 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 yeah, that looks promising indeed. And I do see uh, that we need our sledgehammer to get in there. Yeah, that is the ready prep surplus store. God, this is a cool area too. I like this. Oh boy, look at it in all of its beauty. Get a little nice little screeny of that. When I did that big recording session, I forgot to take screenshots of like the last three or four videos. So I had to go back in, rewatch some videos and make some new screenshots and it was a pain in the butt. Okay, so we need our sledgy boy. Let's walk it out. We'll go back and grab it. I had no idea. I'm going to leave the Humvee up there, though. I don't want to drag anything else down here. I wonder if I need to restart my computer. There might be a Windows update. Seems like they're coming out every other day now. Oh. Okay, yep. Set up. Set up. Set up. Set up. Okay. Uh, you can go on our back. That's the last of the crafted spears that we have. And we'll keep the other ones in our backpack for now. That's fine. Let's favorite these cigarettes. Let's keep them on us. Okay. Um, sledge, diddle hammer. Grab you. Perfect. Love it. Also, welcome to all the new subscribers. And if you're new and just viewing this and you haven't, consider subscribing, my friend. And to anybody who gets gifted memberships, they're always flying out like hotcakes every stream. Thank you guys so much. Uh, make sure to check your membership perks on YouTube and you'll find a link to the members only Discord where we have a lot of fun in there. <laughs> Recruiting more survivors. Are we out of lighters? No. Okay. But I do need another flame source because both those matches and these lighters are dead. Almost dead. Rather. Okay, let's speed walk this out. This kind of reminds me of Bedford Falls, this area. A little bit. But it, it's a lot more finished and nice looking. Bedford Falls just looks like somebody gave up on it. Oh, guns and ammo. Is that the... The sign for the ready prep place? I bet it is. Also, that is like Spiffo HQ. Have I been down here before? Mm. Oh, we came down this way and found the Gigamart. So this was just right here the whole time. That's awesome. I wonder if I can stab through these window shutters. Don't think I can. Yeah, nah. But it's good that we got them all aggroed on that side. I hope. Oh, you sly little baconator. All right. Take down the window bars first. 
get this done. Hopefully there's nothing off on that side. That was totally the bars that I selected, but she took out the window instead. All right, and we're in. Let's equip our spear, put our sledgehammer back into our bag. Seems like the frame rate's finally starting to even out. On a top-down ISO with a 3060 Ti. <laughs> also, what is that? Ooh, that looks like a warehouse to me. Yes, sir, you do. Well, there's a zombie. There's a few zombies on the outside, too. Good night. Good night. Oh! Oh! I seem to have angered the mob. Get! 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 Get here! All right, there's one more in here. I just saw it. All right, now there's no more in here. <laughs> uh, deleted. Before I open that loot window, let's go take care of these guys. I don't want any distractions while I'm getting my loot on. Get out of here. Oh, 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 they all turned around in unison. Do you see that? Like a bunch of weird bugs. Do I have any food on me? No, I don't. That's fine. Uh, we could eat a horse right now. We could also see a man about a horse. Ooh. Oh my god. Yeah, y'all were right when you said this place uh, was worth visiting. Take that buckshot right away. Nine mil. Hell yeah. Bobcat magazine. Take all the loose ammo. Oh. Double barrel, Winchester, seven, uh, 1200 Defender, hold seven. That's awesome. Nine millimeter carbine. Really? Oh, huh. haven't seen that before. 30, 30. Another M9 bayonet. Those are pretty good short blades. An FN foul. Ah, let's say fouling blood level. Contains magazine. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Hell yeah. 1911 magazine. That's, and that's just the first little, uh, oh, I hear something. First little display case there. I think they're coming around from the back. Hello? Oh, yeah. I knew I heard him. Get out of here. Oh. Oh. There's zombies out in the trees, man. Vietnam out here. Also, in between when I last updated OBS and now... I forgot to turn the audio bit right back up for my recording, so hopefully the mic sounds a little bit better now. I see you Baconators out there. More Baconators in there, too. I don't trust going inside that building with only one exit and having zombies around me, so... Come on, where are you? One there, there's two here. Did that aggro him? Yeah. Oh! I got him before the uh, aim outline even... ...took effect. That was awesome. The spear's got range, man. Oi. Oi. There we go. Use that guy to aggro the rest. I don't like having my back to those trees. I really don't. I saw a third one in there. A few crates in here that might have some stuff. Oh. Some fishing supplies. 
Not bad. Bunch of fishing supplies. Uh, hell yeah, I'm gonna mark that on the map. Pause the game, because we're in a really sketchy area. And go like this. Ooh, yeah, that's got to be a warehouse next to us. It looks like a warehouse complex. It's got the too tall barbed wire fence around it and everything. Whoa. Oh, and there's a construction site, too. Okay, cool. Might be able to find some useful stuff there. I also need to revisit McCoy's logging. Um, we're kind of near that. It's down there. Because I never, um, actually went through. I, I believe I went there on foot, and I never, uh, really looted everything, so. Alrighty. I'm gonna have to bring the vehicle down here. There's just so much good stuff. AR-15, 223 rim. Oh my god, yes. The buckshot. That is what I need. And the 9mm. Um, I'm just going to take the things that I use the most. And all the, the loose rounds right now. And all the magazines. But 9mm for the HK MP5. And the buckshot. Hell yeah. Cabbage seeds. I don't need no dang cabbage seeds. Get them out of here. And there's more buckshot in here than the military base. This is awesome. Couple more magazines. 380s. Nice. Oop. More 9 mil. Oh, we're full already. Okay. Uh, we do need to mark this on the map as well. Let's hit the center position button and add a note. Ready, prep. And put an exclamation right there. All right, let's see what else it's got in here. Ooh, a bunch of gear, some 5.56. Five, Portable ham radio. Oh my God, first aid kit, disinfectant, antibiotics. Hunter's thigh protection, eh? Hound Wolf Squad knee pads. Oh, okay. This is a shooting range. Oh, another Kukri machete. Hell yeah, I'm taking that right now. I don't. I don't even care. AK magazine. Oh my god. Is there like a a, a back depot? To, oh, there is. Yeah. That has even more? I think it is, yeah. And unlock that. Uh, so we're going to have to destroy it. I can still hear zombies around me somewhere. Okay, yeah, they're on that door right there, I think. Either that or there's another door right around here. I can hear them. Okay, spears out. For the boys. Put that sledgehammer away. What do we got? Oh, 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 I do need these 556 five, belt links for the uh the big machine gun. Or 556 five, rounds. Cause that's like it's a uh, magazine, I guess. Whoa, what was that? Stormtrooper trench raider Ornister sets? The backpack, ricochet glasses, sniper veil, plate carrier set. So that's like a bulletproof vest. I've never seen that before yet. Linium gas mask. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's another tent. Okay, cool. There is some loot up in this piece. Yeah, we're gonna need like, oh, 
the trailer to loot all of that. Alright, one more, uh, let me just position real quick. This place is awesome. Perfect. Is there anything else around here that's, uh, what is this place? I might have to clear out some of these wrecks to get the Humvee in here, but I am down with that. Take this place for everything it's got. Honestly. It's a movie theater? What is this? It's also a really nice looking condition van. Oh, it is. It's a Starryplex. Hmm. Sir! Start up! Yeah, those ready prep stores are a gold mine. Gold mine. There's a popcorn machine. Popcorn machine and no hot dog roller? What is this blasphemy? Fire extinguisher. Oh yes, chips. You beauty. You savior. Shove those chips down our craw right now. There's another store over there. I want to check out this van, too. No harm in having a used car lot worth of vehicles. Uh, no key. Oh, that's no problem. Got a spare tire as well. Awesome. Eats the world. There's a bargain clothes in there. Dang, this place is huge. What we got over here? Oh, it's a supermarket. Oh, this is the Gigamart, isn't it? I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, man, this place would make an awesome base. You clear out all this crap and put one big wall across it. And then you have all these walls behind you. And a car lot. You could encompass all of this. Your own movie theater. Yeah, and that's a complete wall back there. You just build a wall straight across this. Right here. I want to check out this clothing store a little bit too. Are those crates on top of there? There are. Also, that's an SOS sign. I was wondering what that was. Um, not seeing anything good in here. The zombie, like, right on the other side of that wall. Yeah. I don't know what they're doing. Dirt bike helmet. Oh, <laughs> golf hat. Hell yeah. And a boonie hat. And the Anna's dead bear mask. That's cool. Some stockings. Heather Mason's jacket. Okay. Some more gear and stuff. Oh, so that's where they broke out of, huh? Assassinated. Oh, oh. Okay, and that's the door that leads out to the back where we got those other zombies. Hell yeah. I'm about it. That was nice. Honestly, I thought it would take a, a bit longer to find that building, but... Uh, it did not. I got some more zombies over here. Is this an arcade? Yo! There's a Spiffo's piece of world. A clothing store, and it looks like an arcade in there. Get. Get. And then there's that warehouse back out that way. Oh. Oh, this is a big building, right? Uh-oh. I might have <laughs> woken some stuff up. 
Looks like they've also started breaking out windows in this building. Oh. Oh. Jeez, that's a huge complex. I believe I've spawned on top of that building a few times. And uh, it was immediate death every time. Okay, let's get back to our vehicle. God. <laughs> yeah, as soon as I get near this spot, this is Lag City. Lag City. Okay. I have a little bit of room in there. And everything is pretty much chock full. Let's see. Put a couple bits of ammo in these. Couple bits in you. There we go. That one had a decent amount of space. And in the back, 118 and 130. Okay, we can fit probably the rest of this. And then we can put our sledgehammer up top. Got a good amount of buckshot out of there. Hell yeah. At least five boxes. Uh, let's see. Also, I need food. So let's grab that cereal. What else I got? So five. And I've got six boxes. Nice. Okay. Um, since I put the sledgehammer there, I'm gonna put this. Oh, it's full. Ah! I can put the sledgehammer here. That's right, I did have two of them nine survival knives uh these can go into our bag we got seven boxes of cereal okay i kind of need the sledgehammer to uh fix up these windows that do not have window frames 35 40 p.m though okay let's go inside I don't want to get my giblets not off out here. There's zombies coming from all directions now. Get! Go on, get! Alright, I think we're good. Let's get upstairs. That was my water. Yeah, let's get some water. The sink. Yeah, yeah, it still has got some. Oh, yeah. I like this base. Okay. Oh. Keep that door closed. So I'm pretty much just going to rest for the night. And I'll catch you guys in the morning. Let's see if I can squeeze a little bit more loot into my Humvee. So I'll be right back. Good morning, survivors. All right, so I was checking out this FN Foul. This thing looks sweet. I wish I could zoom in more a little bit, but God, that thing's cool. Also, I figured out it takes 308. Um, if you don't know, I'm not really a gun person. I don't know too many guns. I know the basic stuff, you know what I mean? Like nine millimeter, 45 ACP, 38 special like 44 mag and stuff like that but when it comes to rifles and assault rifles and machine guns i'm clueless <laughs> uh also how's my weight doing i did put oh dang let's just uh scarf down another cereal ate that beef jerky and those chips yesterday and it didn't really help much ah <sighs> so I would like to get the rest of this place fortified. We're gonna need some more metal sheets. I am so out of room in this thing. It kinda sucks. Um, so let's grab our propane torch, welder's mask, and a tank. This one has less, so we'll grab that. Maybe even we'll use that up. Alright, and can I fit this FN Fal in here? Yes, awesome. We also need our sledgy boy, which is up. We'll grab that. Oh, wait, that's the seat. 
Sledgy boy, bada bing, right there. Grab that too so we can take out some of those walls and just build a, either a wall or I might try and build a wood wall and put a metal barrier on it or a wood window wall, sorry, and put a metal barrier on it. And there are some car wrecks down here. Yeah, I figured if I could do two window walls and a metal plate on each, I would increase the hit points of said tile versus just one level three wood wall. Uh oh. Yeah, there are some wrecks down here, but maybe coming down here is not the best idea because of all these big buildings. I like your leg pouch, sir. What is that? Oh, okay. It's kind of the same one I have. I have two of those back at base. Put on our welder's mask. And equipped our torch. Alright. I think we're in the clear for now, so... Dis uh, dismantle this car wreck. I love that this is a thing. We both get materials for barricading out of this, and we clear up the path to make traversing this area easier. Oh, well, there's a zombie up there on the walkway. I was gonna say, why did the music just get louder? God, that place is huge. Got my fingers on the keys, ready to bolt. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? Three here. I'm going to take those. We're a stealth master right now. Speaking of, are we getting XP? A little bit. Not much, though. Six metal sheets for that one. Hell yeah. We're pretty much full now, so let's head back. I'm gonna stay crouched. See if I can't grab some more XP from these guys. Ooh, there's a few over there too. And I think one's following me now. You following me? Oh, there's a couple, huh? You want some of this? Set up! Sweet. I'm going to keep my welding stuff on. Probably move these to the backpack. And let's check out which windows that we can put metal plates on that don't have them yet. And I'm going to have to sledge that little thing down that I built. Is it just this window? Oh, this is one... I think it doesn't have a window frame, but it came like pre-barricaded. What do I not have? Oh, the propane torch is empty. Okay. Barricade metal sheet. Zramp. And can't do that one. Let me see if I can do this one with the one plank on the outside. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a pre-barricaded one I can't do. I'm gonna leave the little barricades there. They'll serve their purpose for now. And you. Zrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Hey, he's got a key to the place, too. And some leather gloves. What's in? Is it anything in here? No. Uh, what a sad existence living in there. Poor guy. We've already got some crates in here, too. This is nice. I'm going to store you in there and you in there. <sighs> Proximity turned back on. You and you. All right. Now we need some wood. Build window walls. There's some trees way down there. What we could also do is disassemble some of this stuff. Pretty risky. Speeding up time. There's one plank and a couple nails. There's another table here. There's two planks. Let me grab these. Put them all in the same spot. Um, grab the nails too. It'd be nice if there was just like <clears throat> a one or two trees around the area. God, there's nothing else. Yeah, there's nothing else. Oh, it's barricaded. Oh, right. I put a metal sheet on there. I totally forgot. There's got to be like a tree somewhere around here. I think we can grab our wood axe now. Should have, yeah, plenty of room. Pop out. Let's take a look at the map. There's got to be like all the way down there or right here or right here. Do I have any ropes? Oh, oh, and I do, yeah. One four log stack would probably go pretty far in this situation, so... I've got 12 ropes. Awesome. Let's grab two. And we'll go back down near the uh, ready prep. Oh, oh! I was looking at the time on the video. Not my character. Very dangerous. Let's get low. All we need to do is take down two trees. Oh, there's some trees right here. Da, 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 da. Stealth tree chopping. Da, 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 da. RCPD, get on the ground. And you, I definitely do not want to exert myself out here. So uh, just one four log stack for now. that in our backpack we go back out on the prowl da, 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 da. keeping zombies off the street yeah we're the RCPD I think this will work too I think I can build I might have to destroy the, the small fence right here but I think I can build I get rid of my sledgehammer? No. Good. I think I can build a window wall on each side. Alright. Let's unstack these bad boys. Drop them. Put this stuff in our backpack. I've got more nails in the vehicle, I'm pretty sure. Saw these up. Do not turn them into drilled planks. All right, get some more caffeine in. <laughs> Speaking of, I was at work, and usually while we're, like, um, processing the pallets and stuff of all the food that comes in. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I put my drink with my green Mio in it inside, like, a cooler, because it's just right there. <sighs> Come on. And this lady came up, she passed it and saw it. She came up and she was like, there's some toxic green sludge sitting in the cooler there. And I was like, are you kidding me? It's obviously a drink. But um, I told her, yeah, it's, it's my uh, antifreeze. It keeps my radiator cool. <laughs> she goes, oh. Huh? Some people. All right, let's hop back out of here. There's some 
toxic green sludge sitting in the cooler there. It's it's in a bottle while you guys are obviously working. Oh, it's a drink. Oh, let's put these spears up. All right, I'm being too condescending. I know. Uh, nails. Let's grab that. Perfect. It just gets annoying after a while. People can be annoying. Every night, people are, uh, like, loading full carts up and then taking them out, like, the back security doors. And it's just kind of crap. All right, carpentry, wall, wooden wall. Nope, nope. Oh, wait, yeah. Yeah, yeah. There is no window wall frame. Ugh. Can I not do it? I do it on that side? No, it doesn't work. Y'all were right. I have to sledge it. It was worth a try. All right, it was worth a try. We'll just build a normal wall there then. Okay. Wall frame. Bada bing. Could put a door there, I suppose, but meh. I don't think we need it. Wooden wall level three. Just bada bing. Gotta do it from the outside. Didn't see any baconators, that's fine. Alright. On to the next, which is right here. Destroy. Hopefully these corpses despawn in the next day or two. I have the degradation turned way up. Okay. Need a refill on planks. And also, I went into my task manager um, because for whatever reason, F1 on the keyboard opens up Microsoft Edge, which is freaking malware. And it taxes the crap out of your computer. Even when you close it, the processes are still going. And as soon as I did that, the game run started running a lot better. You used to be able to uninstall Microsoft Edge using Revo Uninstaller. Uh, that's no longer the case. Which kind of sucks. How many more of these do we have? I think there's two more of these on the other side. These frameless windows, shameless windows. One right here. Five planks on me. I also want to hit that pharmacy at some point. Carpentry, wooden wall frame. Bada bing. All right. And wooden wall level three. We might have enough planks to do this. Another one down? No, we don't. Definitely not. Yeah. All right. We'll leave those on the ground then. And I'll use this for resources for the time being. So we'll put you in there and we'll put our nails in there. We'll put our uh, fighting gear back on. Do you. And then you if i would have spawned in this area early on i might have made this like my main base and that would have been pretty cool actually i would have loved this place to be my main base because i could really deck this out and i wouldn't have those weird glitchy textures from the other houses in there anyways i'm gonna wrap it up here i got stuff that i gotta do today laundry and grocery shopping and all that if you find yourself enjoying the content leave a like and consider subscribing you are one click away from joining the fire nation army and together we will rule the apocalypse uh one day at a time or <laughs> to rule the apocalypse of knox county right now it's bessie foss's time to shine her time in the spotlight currently at 10 months 12 days 15 hours 17 thousand two hundred baconators dispatched i'm fire nation and i will catch you in the next one have a great day out there all you beautiful people and a big thank you to all the channel members patreon supporters and donators you guys are awesome thank you so much have a great day and i'll see you in the next one